looking closely at collisions and activation energy. Collisions play a vital role in chemical reactions. However, a collision between molecules is not necessarily enough to ensure that a reaction will take place. Chemical reactions frequently require the formation of one or more new chemical bonds, which means that the two atoms forming a new bond must be close to each other during the collision. If the molecules have the wrong orientation as they collide, then no reaction occurs because there is no way for the new bond to form. When the orientation of the colliding particles is correct, a new bond can form. The result of this collision is a chemical reaction that converts reactant molecules into product molecules. In addition to having the correct orientation, the colliding particles must have enough energy to break the bonds in the reactant molecules as the new bonds form. The minimum collision energy required for such a process is known as the activation energy for the reaction. If the collision energy is less than the activation energy needed, no reaction occurs. If the collision energy is greater than or equal to the activation energy, and if the orientation is correct, then the reactant bond can break and the new product bond can form to complete the chemical reaction. Because the average kinetic energy of particles increases as temperature increases, a successful collision is more likely at a higher temperature. At a lower temperature, most of the collisions are unsuccessful because the energy of most collisions is less than the activation energy. At higher temperatures, more of the collisions have energy that exceeds the activation energy needed and result in a reaction. A greater number of successful collisions leads to the formation of more products, so the overall rate of the reaction will be greater at a higher temperature. Key takeaways. To summarize, colliding particles will react only if they have both the correct orientation and a collision energy greater than the activation energy. As temperature increases, a greater number of collisions will have enough energy, so the reaction rate will increase.